Hi guys and welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video I have a very special gameplay that I did get with the new pistol that was added into Modern Warfare. I didn't realise this was a free round burst pistol at first. I was doing the challenges for the the general challenges that you do when you level up that you unlock. Um, and it was 30 headshots with a pistol so I put this pistol on and I didn't know there was a free round burst. Um, later on in the tiers you do unlock the um, Guard 1 weapon variant which is this one and that does actually have the burst mod on it uh, which makes this gun absolutely insane. This is the class setup I did use which is the Guard 1 uh, class setup that it comes with. I've not altered anything, I'm trying to unlock a Kimbo but before I did unlock a Kimbo which I still haven't unlocked as you can see. Um, I didn't get an insane gameplay with this thing. Honestly it is absolutely insane, it reminds me a lot of the M93 Raffikas of Modern Warfare 2 if you guys do remember them, or the B23R uh, of, of Black Ops 2. So it's a pretty insane burst pistol, I wouldn't say it's as good as both of them, but it's very very similar. Um, so we have the the class setup is the Desperado Pro Compensator Muzzle, the Mark III Burst Mod Barrel, the Lightweight Trigger, uh, 27 round mag and the XRX Pro XRK Pro Grip. Honestly it makes this gun absolutely insane, I just put it on just thought this is literally my first game using the burst mod with it and I got an absolute tear you guys will see but before we do start this video make sure you guys do hit that subscribe button and make sure you are smashing that like as well if you haven't followed me on my Instagram and Twitter links are in the description make sure you follow them as well anyway guys hopefully you guys are into this gameplay thank you and I'll catch you on the next one okay we are on Hovex Sawmill using the M13 and I've got the uh, new pistol which is like the M93 Rafkas I'm going to get beamed straight off the start from someone camping up top it is a hard point so hopefully we can play objective this time around I'm yet to use this gun with the burst fire mod but um, hopefully it's decent anyway there's two guys here and I'm gonna get killed I need to actually use the pistol though for a start I'm too hooked on the M13 at the minute I'm absolutely loving this gun I didn't really use it too much apart from when I went for Damascus and um, but apart from that I didn't touch it after that seems to have had a little buff I've not actually looked at the patch notes or if there has been any patch notes for season 3 I presume there has but the M13 seems to be a lot nicer a lot better um, could just be a placebo effect where it's just the same and I'm just thinking it is but hey ho I'm not sure how this pistol is going to fare at uh, long range this guy behind that thing should become wall banging but I'm going to have no chance um, let's see if we can see four and there's a hit marker there we'll pick him up no we're going to trade double kill though I didn't even see two people there hey ho we'll take it still using dead silence need to put stopping power rounds but I kind of put it on for the the, uh, I don't even know what the name of the challenges are, my aim's all over though right now, what's going off? I um, don't even know what the challenges are for the, um, what they're called, ooh this kid's going to get killed, hang on, I need to focus real quick, is there anymore? I thought there was another guy, whoa, that kid's, where the hell was the other guy behind me? I didn't even get that other guy who got an assist, but the challenges you unlock from ranking up, uh, I'll go for the 30 uh, pistol headshots, I didn't even know there was a burst fire for this thing, I, just put the, I didn't even put the variant on. I just put the regular uh, pistol on that kid's gonna get killed and um, yeah it was alright I didn't think much of it but now I've got this burst fire I want to really try it out and see what's going off seems decent I mean I've only had two kills with it but hey ho but it doesn't seem too bad to be fair up close I think at range that's where it's definitely going to struggle um, but we will see we will see there's a guy in the hill Hopefully I can tear it up, but I'm getting shot in the back a lot. There seems to be a kid sniping and he's killed me like four times already and it's really frustrating. But I'm level 90 currently as well, so I feel like I'm ranking up pretty well this season. Uh, I, didn't, I only managed to get to like rank 120. Okay, one sec. 120 uh, last season. I literally did next and no challenges, but I've, pretty much, I've done every single challenge I can so far, apart from the flashbang and stuns, and I need to focus. Well, that kid's got pre fire that was lucky. Okay, well, wow, this pistol is pretty decent. I need to change my streaks as well. Oh my days. Oh my days. I've run out of bullets. I can't aim. No, I'm going to punch him. Oh no, no. Oh, thank God he's got a sniper. Jesus Christ. I need to change my streaks because I'm using the cluster. Wow. Losing the cluster strike in the emergency airdrop. Uh, Jesus, this pistol is insane. Wow. Uh, using the cluster strike in the emergency airdrop. Uh, for the challenges, the emergency airdrop's so rubbish it literally drops you like two UAVs at a cluster strike um, so I really need to change them put the VTOL back on uh, and the advanced UAV I think someone's going to come here though real quick so we've got free care packages Let's see what we've got a UAV and a precision airstrike 
and a cluster strike. So the, it is awful, the, the emergency airdrop. I mean, the emergency airdrop of Modern Warfare 2, oh wow, was pretty insane to be fair. I didn't use it a lot, but you could get some decent streaks out of that. And I think you actually got four care packages instead of three on, on that game. Um, I couldn't be, could be wrong, but I've uh, put the cluster strike and the airdrop either side of this hill so hopefully I can defend it and keep it close range with this pistol. Hopefully we can tear it up. Got 17 kills at the moment. Seems to be just dominating this. Uh, oh wow, Jesus! Dominating this hardpoint game. Look at this pistol though. What is my aim, Jesus? How did I survive that? Oh my God, the range. Oh, that kid drop shot at me from all that way. Wow, I think if he didn't drop shot, I would have definitely had him there. But at range, I think this thing is going to struggle. I don't think I think it's going to be well. I don't think it's going to be difficult to get killer gameplay with it. But this is just my initial first thoughts on it. Um, so it's not going to be the best gameplay. This guy here, he's drop shot me again, Lieutenant Dan. Fuck you, Lieutenant Dan. Wow. This kid talking as well. I need to actually mute this kid. He's been talking all game. Super annoying. Wow, Jesus. I mean, if you don't use stim in this game, what are you doing? Helps out so much. So we can see for this guy. How does that see for that game? See, he's pushing close. I think this one. Oh wow! Low, jeez, it's turned around at right at the right time. Literally have no idea where they are. What? This kid with a sniper again? Oh, the I think it was SKS. In fact, I know other than I don't even know what that gun is on the kill feed. Can't tell. It's not the SKS though. But um, yeah, the kid sniping to really get on my nerves. Always close. Didn't even see him there. Teammate picked him up unfortunately though, and that kid's gonna steal my kill with his um Predator missile. What's he cutting me what it's called in this game? Cruise missile. There we go, that's a nice little kill. This gun is insane, it's actually really nice. It's a guy up top on roof. Oh no. How did he how did he snipe me? I didn't couldn't even see him. I'm sorry, I was trying to help. What the hell? Super strange. Yeah. Get my kills stolen from me right now. Is he on the roof still? I'll tell you that's a no. I'm gonna come upstairs anyway, there's a claymore. Oh, we're missing claymores, Jesus. Oh, wow, at range this thing does struggle. It struggles massively at range, which is unfortunate. There's a guy down here. Wow, man, I'm getting destroyed right now. Guy down here, so you can see for him, yeah? Literally been destroyed for the last two minutes. How did that C4 not get hit marker? Jesus, how did that C4 not get hit marker? I'm getting shot in the back. Literally, the last couple of minutes in this game, I've been getting absolutely melted just from long-range engagements like this. The hills, where the hills have been, this hill is a killer as well. I'm no way I'm going to push this hill. I'm going to try, but I'm going to die. Like in range, like that, it's very hard to, you know, get to a decent position with this gun uh, in order to kill someone. But it's to be expected. I mean, it is a pistol. I don't expect it to be like. I mean, to be fair, the M93 graphics of Modern Warfare 2. Wow, there's two. Uh, they could, they was literally a primary weapon, like you could use that as a primary. This thing that you can know, a nice little three piece going off right now though. Put that C4 there, we'll see if anyone wants to run into that in a second, but there's a guy pushing to my left. Oh, I need to, oh I should have exploded the C4. And I would have definitely survived there, but it is what it is. There's not too long left on this game. Uh, to be fair, we have destroyed these in a nice little hard point. I mean I love hard point, there's a sniper up here though. Oh my god, I'm not gonna be able to kill him. No way, that was awful. Playing like that, I should n I should just leave the game after that. Because that is awful. I really should have had at least one kill there. I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna die again. Long range, it's a nightmare. I've been sniped by that kid. Really should have gone for the kid sniping first. God, I think the other guy didn't even see me. But is what it is. We've had a nice few little kills with this thing. I'm getting. How is that kid kill me there? He's just already shooting as he's sliding around the corner. Hate people like that. I think he was just chancing his luck, and that's the most annoying thing. But a range, a range, it suffers. A close range, this thing is a beast. Did get some nice little kills with this thing in this game. First game using the burst mod. I'm going to try and unlock a Kimbo and get an insane gameplay with that though. And this kid sniping again, killing me over and over again. But yeah, it's coming to an end. Insane gun, insane. Okay, guys, we're back in the lobby. I hope you guys did enjoy that video. These are the challenges I've left. Pretty much got them all ticked off, apart from the one, just in case you were wondering, it's just kill enemies that are blinded or stunned five times. I can't go for this personally, I've just got to wait and let it come to me. Uh, to be fair, I've not come across many people using flashbangs or stuns. Um, 
But yeah, it is what it is. And even if I do get stunned, the chances of them coming so I can actually kill them are pretty slim as well. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'll be able to get that ticked off. Really staying on top of the challenge this time around. If you haven't tried this weapon out, try it out. Believe me, unlock the burst mod, it's insane. I'm going to try and unlock a Kimbo uh, to bring an insane gameplay on that as well. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you do hit that subscribe button down below. It means a lot to me. And make sure you do smash that like button as well. Like I said in the start of the video, follow me on my Instagram and Twitter. Links are in the uh, description below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys in the next one.